<laughs> yeah, we did, yeah. Yeah, we did, man. How did you feel coming off the scrimmage? Where things looked like you just jumped right back into a great rhythm. Yeah, I mean, uh, it was a great turnout. The, you know, it was just emotional just being able to be out there in front of the fans, you know, for the first time in a long time, eight months. Um, so uh, I just tried to embrace it. I know I had to get the kinks out in the first couple of shots. Uh, first couple felt good, but I knew once one of them went in, uh, I was going to be back to where, where I was uh, playing. So uh, it was great. I had a great time, and I got to give to my teammates for finding me while I was hot. Do you ever have, I mean, I don't know as confident of a player as you are, is the word relief ever even come into your mind when you – kind of get at least past that first game and, and see the ball go in? Like yeah, that. yeah. I, I mean, I think I can't really answer that question until, you know, the first couple of games. Um, I mean, even though it is a scrimmage, you know, you're still kind of in a in a practice form. But it was kind of realistic, you know, just being there in fans, being on the main court, um, getting a feel for the arena again. And I'm and, um, just embracing, you know, all the love and embracing all the energy that was surrounding you. Um, but I don't think I can answer that question right now. Are you going to be one of those guys that makes a trip up to Tulsa? Is that a couple of nights stay home? <laughs> I don't know yet. We'll see. I mean, we got to see how. I mean, he's going to give us a. I think they're going to send a text out or something like that later. So we'll see. I mean, if it is, I mean, if it is, then we're playing. I mean, if not, then I guess it's what, uh, what, they, what they want from us uh, moving forward. What do you hope to get for whatever preseason games that you do play in? What, what's your. What's your uh, main priority? Just getting my rhythm back. Just getting the rhythm back. Uh, I know if we only have three games, and that's saying a lot. I'm, you know, it's not that many games to get your rhythm back. A lot of guys are, a lot of these teams are playing four or five. But uh, um, just continuing uh, to trust, uh, you know, what the staff wants us to do out there on the floor in practice and in game and. Um, just basically just getting my rhythm for the most part. How do you like or not like three preseason games? Um, typically you play like four or five. Jason said he kind of wanted to get like the data points on fewer games to see how that works. You know, what are your thoughts on that before you have that, that stretch? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I'm just ready to play. <laughs> I mean, I mean. I, I mean, I haven't played since January, so I mean, I'm not the person that asked that question. I, if it was up to me, I'd play every day right now, you know, just to you know get get all the kinks and stuff out. Uh, but like I said, I mean, it's up to what JK and what the staff wants us to do moving forward. We got three. We'll see how it goes. You've been happy with the way you're feeling, like the next day and after going through, you know, practicing all the time. I know often, like you might feel good in a game with adrenaline, but yeah. sometimes it's how you are the next day that really matters. Yeah, I mean, I think I'm recovering very well. Uh, no setbacks. Um, we had a hard practice yesterday. Have a hard practice today. Um, so I feel fine. The body's sore, just like at any other training camp. But uh, for the most part, I feel really, 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 really good. Oh no, the uh, carbon fiber thing. No, 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 I don't have to wear it anymore. That was gone uh, a long time ago. Uh, so I'm good now. <laughs> Jared said after the the scrimmage the other day that he was in uh, with you a couple of times this this summer. He mm -hmm. said the first time he could he could kind of sense that you weren't all the way back yet. Mm -hmm. But then by the end of the summer, he said you looked 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 great. Yeah. Uh, had, was there? Did you notice at what point did you say, all right, this is. I'm, I'm I'm good to go for good. Yeah, I think uh, once I, I mean, for the first time when he came back, when he came and saw me back at home, the first time uh, I didn't get my final finalized, uh, you know, screenings uh, just to clear me for full on go. Um, so I was kind of hesitant at the time, but I still wanted to. I was still able to do the things that I was doing towards the end of the season when you guys saw me out there before games and. And here in practice, doing some things here and there. But uh, once he left, a couple of weeks later, I got the the final say, uh, and I just wanted to focus in and trust my leg a little bit more, trust my foot a little bit more. And once he saw me the next time, uh, I was ready to go. Do you remember what specific day that final? No, was? summertime. July. <laughs> summertime. <laughs> no day. <laughs> summertime. <laughs> <laughs> You're 
they're obviously a big name. The Mavs are getting back a big player for them. There's a lot of these around the league, especially in the West, it seems like. Yeah. Guys that had significant injuries didn't play last year. Are you keeping an eye on any of that? You know, preseason games are starting now. And there's interest to see everybody back healthy. I mean, yeah, I mean, that's human nature. You know, you're going to see everything. I mean, I'll sit here and be lying to you if I said I wasn't paying attention to any of that stuff. Yeah, I am. I mean, that's the competition in itself, competition in, in me. Um, it's great to ha see everybody 100% healthy all around, from Jamal Murray to John Wall to Kawhi, you know, to a lot of those guys, AD, you know. So um, I'm just happy with the fact that, you know, all the guys are healthy and everybody's going to have a great season, I feel like, moving forward, and it's going to be a tough season. So um, I know everybody's up for the challenge.